let's now look at how we can withdraw fiat currency and cryptocurrency from our Binance account here on our Binance app. So we're gonna go to our wallet here on the bottom right and then we're gonna scroll all the way up and click on withdraw. Now let's start with fiat currency. So choose the fiat currency that you have on your Binance account that you want to withdraw. So let's say I want to withdraw some euros and then you see all the options that you have to withdraw that fiat currency to your bank account at, uh, sometimes or also a card. So with euros, you can see that currently you only have the option to withdraw it to a credit card with a 1% fee or you also have the option to withdraw it to your bank account but you're gonna have to use a third party payment processor called ADV Cash. So currently not a lot of options to withdraw euros from uh, Binance to your bank account. Um, however, this really depends on what currency you're actually uh, withdrawing and also where you are located. And also um, when you watch this video, because uh, I've seen that these payment options change a lot here on Binance. So let's check out how it looks like for US dollars. For US dollars, for example, you can actually um, withdraw it to your bank account. However, there will be a 15 US dollar fee. So maybe if you have the option to withdraw different currencies to your bank, maybe you wanna go for a currency that you have more options with where you have to pay less fees or you don't have to kind of sign up for a third party provider. Cool, so now let's look at how we can withdraw some cryptocurrency from our Binance account to our wallet or some kind of other exchange wherever you want to withdraw to. So let's go to our wallet icon here on the bottom right and then click on withdraw here on the top. And now we're gonna go to the crypto tab and decide on what cryptocurrency you want to withdraw. So let's say I want to withdraw some Cardano right here. So I'm gonna choose Cardano. And then you wanna type in or actually paste the address of your Cardano wallet or your other exchange that accepts Cardano in this field right here. So I've already copied the address, so I'm gonna just paste it in here. And then you wanna decide on the network, so make sure you choose the connect network uh, as well. So automatically recognize that this address is a uh, Cardano network address. So I'm gonna choose the Cardano network. And then let's say I want to transfer over 100 Cardano. And uh, now I can actually click on withdraw. And by the way, here on the bottom, you're gonna see how many you're gonna receive. So currently the transaction fee on the Cardano blockchain is one ADA, so one Cardano, which is about uh, $1.20 uh, at the price that it is right now. So let's click on withdraw. Then again, we have to confirm. Okay, that's fine. I'm gonna withdraw 100 Cardano, 100 ADA, confirm. And now we have to confirm the transaction by first of all sending a code to our email address and then typing in the code right here and then also uh, pasting our two-factor authentication code in right here. Uh, I have set it up, so uh, I'm using Authy. You can also use Google Authenticator, or if you haven't set that up, you're probably simply gonna get a code to your, uh, as a text message to your phone, which you then have to paste in here. So get all these codes, codes, paste them in here, and then click on submit. And there we go, withdrawal request submitted. So now uh, the 100 ADA is actually uh, withdrawn and it will show up in a couple of minutes on my ADA on my Cardano wallet.